Uh, my name is Ismail Ahmed, and I'm playing with the uh, Lebanese uh, team, Riyadi, from Lebanon. And I'm playing like power forward, uh, but I'm already Egyptian. So I'm the third or the first or the third professional in this team. Adams. You know, as all my life, I spent my life like a pro uh, uh, overseas in, in, in Lebanon, in Lebanese team. You know, so I played in, in, in Lebanese team most of my life uh, because my wife she's Lebanese also. So it's good to hear that uh, I have already in, in Holland. You know, it's good. It's good for me to have a good reputation here. And uh, yeah, I'm enjoying it. Yeah, it's good for me. <laughs> uh, at the end of the second quarter, you almost lost the game. What happened? You know, when we get the lead, like like 15 or 18 points, uh, and with, with, with some bad calls, it's, it's not bad calls, you know, but it's nervous calls from the referee. They take it like personal. They make the other team come back to the game. And we are not focusing enough on the, our free throw because like the coach, he said, we got like 57 free throw, we had 37. So it's too hard for the team. Uh, it's took the lead 18 points with bad calls and we're not focusing on our shots and the free throw. Uh, make the other team come back. Uh, but because we are organized more than the other team, because they are maybe free agent, they're looking everybody for his job. So they play like an organized team. Uh, but us, when we come back and stick together, we came back to the game and uh, we won it by, by our defense. Are you satisfied? I'm not satisfied because this kind of game was supposed to beat this team by like 30 points and more. Uh, but it's good, you know, uh, big t big teams, they know how to win in the end. And what that's what happened with us. And uh, congratulations for us, hard luck for the other team. And I think our, our satisfaction is going to come with the semi-final and inshallah in the final, if we're going to win it, I will be satisfied. Okay. Uh, you've now played in Holland. Is there a big difference between Lebanon and... Holland? The European leagues is different, you know. It's here, you know, the Arab countries, it's good. Lebanon is the, 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 best, the best country in all Arab uh, have basketball, you know. So, and you can see, you can see from our team, you know, most of our team, they are Lebanese. Lebanese players they are local, maybe only three foreigners. It's me and me, I, they, 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 they count me like Arab, Arab, Arab guy. So it's two American with the other player. So you can, you can judge our team, you know, if, in Lebanon have basket, good basketball or not. But the European league is different because here, you know, it's all like open, open together, you know, so you can bring from outside, not American. So it's make good contact with the player and it's good confidence for, to the player to play outside of Holland and come to play in Holland. That's different between European league and Arab league. That's why, you know, Holland is good. But uh, we still, we still, we can, uh, we can, we can adjust with our league. Uh, but Lebanese is good. Lebanon basketball is good, and Holland also. It's, uh, I like it. Would you like to play in Holland? Uh, it's not, it's not bad, you know. It's, but I'm 36 old now. <laughs> I think I'm gonna go old now to play in European or different countries. It's not about Holland or another country. But when you get old, you need to play in uh, some places. They know you already, you know, because when so, because the, the 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 sport sometimes you go up, sometimes you go down. So when you go down, everybody is know your level and you know how 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 you're gonna play. So it's new country for me. It's gonna be hard to play because nobody knows you. So if one game you're not good, they say it's bad player, send him home. You know. So I prefer to stay now after 36 years old. I can I prefer to stay in Lebanon or. The, the country, they know me already. And tomorrow you're going to play again? What are your chances? Uh, tomorrow is my national team. Because I'm Egyptian, like I told you, tomorrow is my national team. So I will not going to play against my national team. Uh, because it's happened before. And I said, and the coach is accepted, you know, and they understand that. Uh, against my national team, I can't play. So I apologize for my team and my coaches and my, te my, my teammates. And they understand. I, I'm not going to play tomorrow. 
And last question, what's your wish for 2013? You know, uh, my wish is come to the, the peace of the world and what happened in the Arab countries and everybody's uh, kill, killing each other, you know. And I I, I hope if the, the all the problems has come and fix it and uh, what happened in Syria and what happened in Palestine, Palestinian. And what happened in Egypt, you know, what happened in Egypt is also ter terrible, you know. I don't, I don't, I don't like my country to be like this. So I wish every, every, everything is calm, calm, and everything it's for peace. And all the people they go out of their countries and their kids are uh, shooting, and you know, that's all fixed. And because nothing in the world deserves that what happened in uh, our regions.